What's up guys, it's Katie. Welcome back to Steal the Spotlight. Today I have a good old fashioned how to style video with a focus on blazers. They are a huge trend this year and also kind of a wardrobe classic. People have been rocking these for decades, so there's definitely a lot of inspo already out there, but I figured today I would add to it with six ways I like to wear them. Sometimes blazers can get a bit of a bad rap, I suppose because they are often associated with more of a dull workwear sort of vibe, but that definitely doesn't have to be the case, which is why I wanted to share this outfit first. This color is just gorgeous and totally elevates this into more of a fun, playful look. But my favorite part is definitely the proportions of this outfit. Teaming that cropped bralette with the high-waisted trousers already really elongates you, but then throwing on that long line blazer and with the vertical stripes, it makes you look so much taller. This second look brings us back to more of an old school preppy style, which in large part is actually thanks to the blazer itself. This style totally reminds me of Sherlock Holmes. I think that that check tweed sort of vibe definitely gives off an old man feel. So I think that the lace turtleneck underneath really does make a world of difference in this case. And to finish off the look, I just wanted to stick with that 70s warm color palette by going for the mustard mini skirt and brown boots. Another great way to style a blazer is to go all out and opt for a two-piece suit. These have been really trendy over the last year, so you can find them at a lot of high street places. But this one I got from the thrift store for only $10 such a steal considering how many different ways you can style it. One of my favorites is just to keep it simple, white tee and a pair of Chuck Taylors, but you can totally elevate the look as well. Personally, this is probably my favorite look out of the whole bunch. I think it looks a million bucks and it is so simple just to team that lace bodysuit underneath and then a really classic pair of pumps. I think the trick to this one is definitely the more simple, the sexier the look will be. So keep that in mind for hair and beauty as well. Look number five features the absolute classic wardrobe pairing of jeans and a blazer. Trust me, this one never goes out of style and it's so easy to update from season to season. It's really simple. You can change the cut of your jeans, the color of your t-shirt, try a different graphic, new accessories. Really, the world is your oyster with this one. Clearly, I am still hanging on for dear life to the pink and red color combo trend, so that's how I decided to style it here today. I thought we'd finish it off with an outfit definitely more outside my usual comfort zone, but I saw this amazing picture of Bella Hadid styling her oversized blazer with a pair of cycle shorts, and I really wanted to give it a go. Trust me, I never thought I'd be a fan of cycle shorts, but this outfit really, really surprised me. I think it turned out great. I'm still not really sure what occasion I would actually wear this to, but I am very keen to break it out as soon as possible. That about wraps up today's lookbook though, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please remember to give it a big thumbs up. Let me know in the comments which outfit was your favorite, as well as which items you want to see me style next. I'm thinking sneakers, maybe like the dad sneakers specifically, so stay tuned for that. Thanks again, guys. Mwah.